Hi, like I'm uh, Francesco Donadello. I'm coming from Italy originally. I'm a sound engineer and producer from Berlin. I have my recording studio there and I do a lot of piano and acoustic type of music. And most of the time also a lot of uh, soundtrack. My studio partner actually is from here, from Amsterdam. That's my very close connection, let's say, with the, with the Netherlands. I love this type of recording that embraces both electronic music but also acoustic production. I would say the best of the two words put together. I simply got an email from Steven. He was describing me all the details of the project. I just got the demos and I listened to and I was very interested to hear the energy that was coming from him when he was relating, you know, talking about this project. Yeah, it was definitely my cup of tea, I would say, to work with uh, this project. If on this type of music, Stephen is the first person from, from Netherlands to collaborate with me on this kind of music. Yeah. He really gives you a lot of space, doesn't put any pressure at all and uh, it's very open and uh, to receive any kind of idea that I can come you know on the table some other artists maybe are more like uh, just follow what's in their head and then he's actually very very open to upset suggestion it's a very great work relationship I would say for example in the song that we just did there was one part that he was not sure and then we were wandering around and tried to figure out what to do with that if we just fix it just come up with the, some creative process and we did actually come up with something it's very nice to be able to have the freedom to actually do it that as in, in the last stage which is this one with, where you mix an album i tend to use uh, a lot of vintage gear, uh, some very, very old machines sometimes. I just like this organic sound that new technology like computer and other digital type of processing, it's, it's very difficult to achieve it with that kind of technology. So I prefer to use something that is actually almost half working, maybe not perfectly working, but it gives you some something that you know the digital doesn't give you. The digital gives you like a lot of potential, a lot of versatility. You can use it in many, many different ways. It's great, but there's still something that comes from a quirkiness, uh, like a, a randomness that the uh, analog vintage machine has, especially tape machine or like uh, some weird uh, analog effects. Uh, I, do, I wouldn't see myself doing a production without a computer, but I definitely want to have a little bit of secret tools <laughs> in every production I do. I did work with some other uh, Dutch artists, which are completely different type of music. I work with a band called Kensington. I was recording drums for them, which is a beautiful uh, studio with a great collection of gear that uh, was also very inspiring to create something different and just get out a little bit from my comfort zone of my own uh, environment. We were considering different studio, but I feel like that this was having the right amount of strange gear and a uh, nice vibe all together. And um, so this was actually a really nice choice at the end. <laughs>